The name is Detective Carl. I'm a lone wolf, a man on a mission, where my captain might call a loose cannon. I only love three things, solving mysteries, fighting crime, and of course a lukewarm hot dog covered in ketchup and sweet relish. A college kid named Andrew has gone missing. It's my job to find out what happened to him. Let's get to it. On the case! Alright, in order to find Andrew, I need to take a look into his room. Of course, right this way. Hmm, this is a nice room. Does he usually keep it this tidy? Uh, not usually. Um, he's been better about picking up after himself. Watch out for that skateboard. What's that? I meant to do that. So, does it look like anything is missing? No, I couldn't find his wallet. He just has a guitar in here and that's missing too. Hmm, interesting. How long has it smelled like up dog in here? Up dog? What's up dog? Nothing, what's up with you? <laughs> I'm sorry, but have you noticed anything strange about Andrew lately? He's usually in a bad mood. He's been in a better mood lately. Now that you mention it, he's been a lot busier. Busier? Well, not busier, I guess. He's been doing different things than what he normally does. Like he used to skip class with us and go to the mall and go shopping and just have fun. He's just been doing different things lately. He's been carrying this around a lot. A Bible? Has he always carried this around? Uh, no, just recently. Hmm, interesting. Is this his computer? Uh, sure is. Do you think there's a clue on it? It could. He hasn't been answering his phone, but with the help of this computer, we could probably find his location. Hmm. Aha! I found it! Really? Where? <laughs> Hold on to your goldfish. We're going to church. Thanks again. Watch out! Church, huh? From what I've heard about Andrew, church is the last place he'd ever be. Skipping class, grumpy attitude, and a habit for leaving skateboards where people walk. This Andrew was bad news. Or was he? Either way, I was beginning to feel like I was heading in the right direction. Excuse me, sir. Do you work here? Yeah, I do. Uh, Taylor. Pastor Taylor. I work with the young adults here at Waffle. Excuse me, did you say Waffle? Yeah, Waffle. Waffle Church. You, you know, because we love you uh, waffly a lot. You get it? You know, because uh, Waffle. Very cute. Now, do you know an Andrew Applebottom? Sure I do. He's a great kid. When's the last time you saw Andrew? Last Sunday, because I remember him saying he loved the story of Matthew 25, the parables, the bags of gold. <laughs> All right, bags of gold. Finally, I'm detecting a motive for his disappearance. Got it. Now tell me everything you know about these bags of gold. Well, it's a parable from the Bible. A wealthy man gathers his servants and gives them gold to take care of while he's gone. Some got a lot of gold and some got less. Anyway, some servants used the gold for good and made even more money for their master. But one, he buried the money. When the master came back, he was happy with the two that did something with the gold, but, you know, not so much with the other person who chose to do nothing with the gold. The story encourages us to do well with what God has given us. Uh, that's basically it, pretty much all I know. Hmm, interesting. Do you know how long snails can sleep for? Um. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure up to three years. Aha! You do know more! So I need you to give me more information on Andrew. Tell me everything you know! I'm not sure if this is a good idea, because I really don't even know you. Listen here, Pastor Tater Tot. It's Taylor. I don't care! The only thing I care about is finding out where Andrew is! So the way I see it, you have two options. You can tell me what you know and go about your day here at the Pancake Palace. It's waffles. Or, we can do this the hard way. What's the hard way? <laughs> What in, the, what in the world? You're probably wondering where you are. And to that I say- Interrogation room number four? What? How'd you know that? It says it right there on the door. Who do you think you are? Some type of wise guy? Let's see how tough you are after this. That wasn't my hand. <laughs> so Andrew's last location. Can you guess where? The church? Wrong, the church, wait. Oh yeah. Yes, the church. 
But what I find interesting is that Andrew's never been to church before. His friends and family claim that he suddenly began to go to church. Started reading his Bible a little over a month ago. They also say that this is very out of character for Andrew. Then apparently his guitar and valuable belongings are missing. So I ask again, Pastor Taylor, where is Andrew? I don't know, but I know where his guitar is. Huh? It's at the church. <gasps> You're the culprit. Deputies, arrest him. No, no, you've got it all wrong. Andrew left it at the church. Why would Andrew bring his beloved guitar to church and leave it there? Hmm? Answer me that, preacher man. Do you not know? Andrew's been volunteering at the church for like weeks. We found out he could play guitar, so we asked if he would want to serve on the worship team. And he was so excited to be involved, everyone there loves him. Hmm, okay. Well, what about his other belongings? Half of his clothes in his closet are missing. His money? Gone! Explain that. Oh, well, I'm not 100% sure, but he's donating a lot of stuff to those in need. I bet that's where it all went. <sighs> this doesn't make sense. I don't get it! Andrew's one person then changes his whole pattern and disappears? I really don't know why you're even talking to me. You should be talking to Billy. Billy? Wait, who's Billy? Billy's Andrew's best friend. For the past month, he's been spending a lot of time helping Billy. Find Billy? I bet you'd find Andrew. All right, I gotta find this Billy. If I find Billy, then I find Andrew. Then I close the case. Ouch! Can I leave now? <sighs> yeah, you're free to go. Not really. Just kidding, you can go. So... Psych. You can go. Yes? No, you can't. <laughs> you can go. Don't yes. leave. Are you... you can go. Go on, get out of here. No. Okay. You got it. Yes. Stay! Okay, no, for real, you can go. Oh. Now I'm one step closer to finding Andrew. One step closer! <laughs> Why is there a skateboard here?